I don't know if you noticed, but those credited for writing the screenplay of this movie were John O. Killens and Nelson Gidding. Well, somebody else also wrote a major portion of the script, but didn't get credit. And that was Abraham Polanski. His name was erased because at the time this film came out in 1959, he was still blacklisted due to that infamous House Un-American Activities Committee witch hunt, which hit Hollywood in the late 40s and early 50s. This movie was made several years after the Red Scare ended, but studios were still afraid to let people called before that jury, such as Abraham Polanski, have a screen credit. All that changed, though, just one year later, in 1960, thanks to Otto Preminger and Kirk Douglas as producers, giving screen credit to blacklisted writer Dalton Trumbo on the movies Exodus and Spartacus, respectively. By the way, if you enjoyed this film and would like to see it again, it's available on demand for the next seven days via our new app called Watch TCM. With the app, you can watch TCM live and watch hundreds of films on demand each week on your computer, mobile phone, or tablet. It's a great new service we're pleased to be offering to our cable and satellite subscribers. You can find out more about the app on our website, tcm.com slash watch TCM. Up next, more from Harry Belafonte. This time, Harry in a charming film with Harry playing an angel sent down to earth to assist an elderly Jewish tailor played by the wonderful Zero Mistel. Tonight on Turner Classic Movies, Harry Belafonte strives to earn his wings in the Angel Levine. Then see where the stars live in Hollywood, my hometown. And J. Carol Nash heads to court with a bickering couple in No Other Woman. Great, great.